Now we are going to start the chapter of stuffing. Do it up. First, what is the meaning of the stuffing? First thing is that what is the meaning of the stuffing? Actually, stuffing is the process which we are using for the just collection or select or appointed for the right person of right place. That is called the stuffing. The right person on the right place. That is called the stuffing because in every business, many type of place will maybe open for the. Registration are open for the new appointment or training. But by the utilizing of the staffing, we are going to take the right person on right place. The process by which we are doing these all things that is called staffing. Okay, beta. That is called staffing. Okay. Next topic is what? Next is the importance of staffing. That. Next is the important of staffing. First is filling the room by obtaining a job. Filling the room by obtaining a job. By that we are going to take the right person because you will know about that any vacancy is coming, then many type of person is going to fulfill that vacancy. Now, beta. But by the staffing we are going to select the right person. Or you say select the person. That we require for our business. That we require for the our business. Okay, beta. Next. Okay, placing right person or right job. You have the vacancy for the accountant. Then you are not going for the engineer, beta. You are just going for the accountant. You are giving the advertising for the accountant. And that all things done in where? In the process of the stuff. Okay, next. By the utilizing of staffing, we are going to take the right person and right place. Then their person is giving his hundred percent, and when that person is giving the hundred percent, then sure and certain your business will grow because you have the right person and right place. They are giving his hundred percent. They are doing the right things, and that will improving the growth of the business. Next, help in competition. I think you well know about that. In that time, many type of competition, very big competition in the market, and for the standing of this market, needed the right person, needed the person. They are self motivated, and for the selecting of this type of person, we needed. The right person. We needed the person which is required for our business, which is needed for our business. Okay, beta. That type of person we needed, and that person coming by the process of staffing. Next, improve job and motivation of the employee. Okay, improve motivation or job, motivate of the employer and employee. When you are Doing the become, and then you are take the post of the accountant, then you are satisfied. Okay, but you are going the CA, but when you get the as accountant, you are not satisfied. You want the upper place, senior accountant, account manager, financial manager. You need it, beta. When you are just take that type of job, then you are satisfied. So by the staffing, they try to give the right person right job. Write this and take him satisfied. Next, information of other person. Just when the all thing is going good, I you well know about that. The person is very important things in any business. Okay, person is a very important thing in business, and they are just going to affect the all type of things. Done in the business. If the right person and right place, everything is same. So then, other things will also affect. Okay. Next. Starting and business business. Starting and 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 business. Starting and
for the start, just for the starting of the recruitment or the place where this post is coming to up to satisfaction satisfaction of the person. Then all thing is coming in where that is coming in HR human resource management. The full form of HR is what human resource management. In this human resource management, we are going to start of the point of that things where this post is created. It means where we are going to see which type of person needed after the making of the business, after the just developing of the business, we are needed the person of different different type. That person we are including in this staffing beta, in this acharam, okay. And from that place, then which type of person we needed, how much person we needed, number of person we needed, which type of qualification we needed, which type of quality training we needed. After that, giving the advertisement, selection form is coming, then selection. After the selection, appointment or taking the selection process, offering the job, then joining the job, then terminology, employment condition is created by the needed of that person or related of that job and then give the appointment and then after appointment give the training or just facing with the business these all things coming in a HRM because it means what? Human resource management. How to manage this human as a resource that all things is coming in a human resource management. Okay, beta? Clear? Okay, next. Human resource planning. In this human resource planning, beta, we are going to plan from the downside. That is the same thing. First, we are going to see which type of person we needed, where the vacancy, where the job, then how much person we needed, which type of person we needed. Then we are giving the recruitment. We are giving the vacancy in market. Then application will came. Then shortlisted of that application. Then taking the different different way for the selection as like an interview or an interview, written interview. Then health checkup after the selection, health checkup. Then term and condition, sharing the term and condition, and then offering the job. These all things is just a process of human resource management or planning of taking the humans. Okay, beta. Next. Then career growth. This human resource management is thinking about the career growth. Because by this human resource management, they are given the right person on right place. And when you are getting the right place, you are given your 100% and then your career will develop. Next. Motivation. Motivation. Same thing. You are on right place, then you are motivated. If you are down place, you are not motivated. Maybe you are getting upper place, then also motivated. You are just a GCOM, simple GCOM, and you are getting the account rate, okay, it's okay, no problem. But you are getting the low side job, you are not motivated. You are getting the upper side job, then you are motivated. Okay, very good. I am getting the more, then I am doing the extra effort. We are going to see the all the things, we, how we are doing, how we are doing, and then come in office, and then again start. Okay, I will try, I will try. Then you are motivated motivate for the doing, self motivated for the doing extra. Okay, beta. Next. And when human resource management is working, then they are doing the right person, right job, and right place. Then this social security is what? Social security means fulfill the social needs. Then you are getting the right job. Then you are easily fulfill your social needs, beta. Next. What? Then you are authorized by that. We are giving the authority and authorize the places. Okay? Authorize the things. You are working for this. You are working for this. You are getting the place for this. Next. Staffing process. Now we are going for the next is the is staffing process. Okay, beta? It's a process, a very lengthy process. Then we are going for this is staffing process. Okay, first is beta. First is recruitment. Yeah, no? 
First, which type of manpower requirement we are going to see for this in our business? It means first we are going to just research or search or study or taking the information about that in which type of person we needed. Which type of person we needed with us. Okay? And after the taking of that person, how we know? How we know? By the just researching, by the just taking the place. If we needed accountant, so we are going for the accountant. We needed worker, then we are going for the worker. We needed engineers, then we are going for the engineers. And that thing, things, how we are know? That things we are going to know by the taking a research or taking a search of our business. In which type of person we need it. Okay, beta? Clear? Okay, next. Then recruitment. Recruitment is beta. Recruitment is the process by which we are going to introduce the outsider with the, our posters or our vacancies. The system by which we are going to introduce our open or giving the information about your poster, your post, your vacancy, your job to the public or other person. That system is called recruitment. Okay, beta? That is called recruitment. Okay, next. Selection. Selection. Next is the selection. That all will come as a big, big point, beta. Now the rest all we are going. That all will come. Selection is what? Selection is the process that we are using after the recruitment. Application is given. Okay, then you are going to start the process of selection. Maybe in this process we are going to use written exam, oral exam, personal interview, medical exam. This all type of examining we are utilizing in this selection process and by that we are going to select the person. Okay, next. Yes, and then after the selection, we are going to place. We are just giving the offering the person that okay, this vacancy is open, this vacancy is remain, and you are as a selected for that place. Can you like to job join this place or you like to join this place? Because we are going to select you on this place. Next. After the selection, we are giving the training and development. Because maybe that person is trained, maybe that person has very good knowledge, maybe that person is very, very extraordinary, but they are not easily related with your business beta. They are not easily related with your business. So, we are going to give him some training. And by the training, we are trying to develop that person. We are trying to develop that person, that personality, that working style, that all the different things. Okay, next performance. Then by this we are going to try to improve the performance of that person. Clear? Next. Promotion and career plan. Then giving a promotion for the motivation. For the motivation we are giving the promotion and career plan. How to promotion? We are giving the next post. Maybe we are giving the transferring transfer of the this, uh, nearest post, okay, beta? nearest place or giving the career planning kit, we are just giving some extra courses for you, free of course, and you are just seeing this some companies just sending his own employer, employee to other country or other institute for the getting the training, free of that training, that is what, that is the career planning, okay, next, time is, time is, time time place okay and by that we are going to take the time place okay for that we are going to take the time place clear this all the 14 sir. 14 one four fourteen okay this all what this all the system Okay, this is all the system that we are going to follow. Okay? okay after that, what's on this? That training or development we are giving the performance. Because if any person giving the good performance, we are giving the more chances, we are giving the more facilities, not performance. It means we are going to try to motivate the person on the 
basis of his performance or on the basis of his quality, we are giving the more chance by giving the more type of things. Next, element on the topic. What? Element on the topic. Okay, now we are going for the element of the topic. Up to this, next, I will solve after that. Okay, beta?